Hey guys, it's me, Strike Rage, and welcome to part one of Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations. So, here is the long, long awaited LP that I've been wanting to start forever. I am so pumped for this Let's Play. You guys have no idea. I've been wanting to do a Generations Let's Play since I've started YouTube, and now. I am at 2,000 subscribers, and I said I was going to start when I hit 2k, and we did a couple days ago, and that is amazing, you guys. I am actually currently working on a little special video for that, so stay tuned for that. So the two lovely sims we are currently staring at is Selena Price and Jacob Stevens. So right now, they're a girlfriend and boyfriend. They are not like engaged or married or anything yet, because I want to do that on the let's play because i think that will just add to the whole generations aspect and these are my favorite types of let's plays to do because i love family-based lps they're just the most fun we're gonna teach our teens how to drive we're gonna have toddlers and we're gonna explore the daycare and it's be such a fun time so before we jump right into everything i want to quickly introduce you guys to the sims show you their traits and tell you a little bit about them and then i will show you the house and then we will hop right into a little bit of gameplay. So this sim right here is Selena Price, as I had said before, and her traits are family-oriented, natural cook, avant-garde, hopeless romantic, and nurturing. And nurturing came with generations, which is why I gave her that trait. And avant-garde, because I see her as a very creative, artistic type, and I, I don't know, I just feel like that will really contribute to uh, the personality in the let's play and I really my sims are very crazy and you will see that throughout the let's play so I like to give them a bit of a personality and a twist to their traits so that's why she has avant-garde and she's a natural cook because we need a good cook in the house for good food and family oriented because this is a family based let's play favorites are pop waffles and spice berry and she is currently a young adult and she is a Gemini just like me <laughs> and over here is Jacob Stevens. He is my little hottie and I just love him. I think he is so cute and you guys don't even know I made him like very attractive looking. So he has rebellious, a great kisser, family oriented, irresistible, and a little bit of a klepto because I always need to send that the klepto. I need to steal things because that's a must because we are going to have those times we have no money and the only way we're going to survive and support our family is steal. So we have ourselves a little club dough and he is a bit of a bad boy. But I will show you throughout the let's play when he becomes a father and gets married he will uh, learn that life's not all about partying and that he needs to really commit to his kids and he is going to be that type of father. He is, trust me he's going to be a good father even though at the beginning of the let's play he's gonna be a little bit of a bad boy i want them to kind of live life a little bit before they have a big family which i promise most of the let's play will be family based but just the beginning while they're boyfriend and girlfriend i'm gonna cut them some slack a little bit before they um really dive right into their big life that awaits them because remember they just got out of college and they just moved into this little Queen's house together. Oh, girl, I need to fix that. That's not cute. Alrighty, so here is our little quaint house. This was made by my friend Harley, so shout out to her for making this beautiful starter home because I could never come close to anything this cute. Never. And uh, since we are broke, I cannot really add anything like uh, lights or any more landscaping, even though, trust me, I would when we get more money. We will, but this is what we could afford. So this is the outside, I think it's so adorable, and I will quickly go ahead and give you guys a little bit of a tour of inside the house. So over here, once you walk in, we have our little living room, and it is very small and simple, but like I said, we have, we're have we broke, so we can't really do anything about it. I had to delete the curtains here because we couldn't afford the house, so I had to delete them so we could afford it, so that's sad really breaks my heart but this is the little living room we have going on then over here we have my kitchen 
which I also had to delete the bar stools because we had no money, which is very sad. So we can just eat on the couch now. But hey, I think it's all good for now. Uh, we have our little curtains, which I love. Yeah, super cute. And then over here, we have Selena's and Jacob's bedroom, which is just a bed and we have some lights. So yeah, once again, very sad because we have no money. But I love the theme. I love the green theme. It's kind of neutral and green. It's really pretty. Then we have the bathroom, which I love this big curtain here. This is so adorable. I love the purple and it's just very simple. I mean, we have really cheap appliances, but it's still cute, you know? I really like it. And then over here, we have the little nursery. I love the yellow theme going on. Trust me, like I said, when we get more money, we will spice things up a little bit because this is kind of sad. Uh, but we have a little xylophone here in our little crib. And yeah, you guys, this is the house. I think it's super cute on the outside. I love the little flowers. And the tree was supposed to be here, but no money. So that's why we have to get a job, like, right now. So, um, first off, I want them to go ahead and check out the house, please. Can you, like, just do me this little favor? Just step in the house for the very first time. He's like, well, yes, honey. Okay, so we are going to go ahead and uh put selena in the daycare career because that came with generations so uh is the newspaper here yet or can i just call is that an option oh we have our little camos we can sell that 850 simoleons honey you best believe i'm doing it does he have one? Oh, i feel like this is cheating but hey at least we have some money to uh Hold on uh, to- Wrong LP. Wrong LP. This is not university. So, uh, leave. Leave. Oh, she's really pretty, though. She has the custom skin, though. No. Leave. Don't even bother answering the door. But we- <laughs> Same. When someone rings the doorbell when I'm home alone, I freak out. Okay, we're gonna sell that, though, because- that's money. So yeah, but she came with a little street art kit because I guess of her little, um, what is it? Her avant-garde traits. So that's very helpful. But here's the newspaper girl. So we're going to look for jobs and professions, find a profession and see what's available for us. Okie dokie. So we have the lifeguard. No, but here's the daycare. All right. So, I did not have ambitions, which is why you guys are like, oh, I'll take care of my lifeguard, that sucks, but I don't have money. Okay, here's the daycare. So, yes, we will quickly read this little uh, caption box here so we get the idea. Do you have what it takes to keep toddlers and children happy? If it's feeding, playing, and changing dirty diapers sounds attractive to you, this profession might be your calling. Eventually, you will also be able to care for children as well as toddlers and make sure they're on the right track to success in school and properly behaved. Start caring and teaching kids in this town now. All right, I'm really excited. And we work 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Mondays through Thursdays. So, yes, we will accept the career and I'm so excited. So, uh, I think our work day will start Monday, if I'm correct. So, that is very exciting. All right. And, uh, whoops, whoops, okay. Uh, Jacob, I am not sure what I want him to be. I have absolutely no idea. Um, how about you give him the newspaper so we can just look in there first and see what is there to offer. So we're gonna find a job. Alrighty, so we have the criminal career, no. Science, military, hmm. So, I'm leaning either towards the military career or a doctor. And the thing about the doctor is that sometimes once you get in, like, the higher part of the career, they will call you in the middle of the night and just at random times. And that kind of really stings. But I know when you reach, like, level 10, which I've done that before, you work, like, two hours a day, which is amazing. And you get paid a phenomenal amount of money. So I'm actually leaning more towards a doctor, even though I kind of see him more in the military. I don't know. I think I'll do military for now, and if anything changes, 
I will go have him be a doctor. But for now, I really see him as a, like in the military, not as a doctor. So yes, we will accept the military career. And I just think it suits him more, really. All right, so we have our job now, which is really exciting. And um, so what is this? I don't know. Okay, anyways, I am just so excited for this Let's Play, you guys. So, um, I have no idea where to start. No idea where to start with us. Okay, what does he want to do? Send a text to Jenny Wickle. Okay, I have no idea who that is. You are not joining the criminal career. Uh, but he wants to buy a street art kit. I think that's what I want her to do. I want her to start on her street art, which seems really weird to do for the first part. But, uh, I think that's what I want her to do. Like, I really want her to get into that. Okie dokie. So, uh, oh, you're giving it already, honey? Oh, okay. Okay. Yes, girl, get it, boo, get it. Okay, so let's start off by doing some street art, I guess, on the side of her house. I mean, that's gonna ruin it, but I don't really want to get caught by the police in the first part, so let's just do it in the back where no one can see it because that will just ruin the whole view okay oh wait what am i doing okay do you have to like click on it i've never done this before is that sad is it bad that i okay tag wall here we go do a small tag right here in the back of the house and uh, i've never done this before because i'm a noob with the sims just kidding just kidding i've never really done street art which is probably really weird to you guys but I'm sure this is gonna be ugly, so you know it's always the first time they're the ugliest. Oh, some hot pink up in here. Okay, I have no idea what that means. Um, but we will now clean that up. Can we clean it? Oh wow, she's critiquing it. Okay, clean that up. I did not want that in the house. Please and thank you. I guess it's just for um working on, on her skill but ooh, it's the ice cream truck yes boo okay so uh actually i want to buy an ice cream tree why the heck not why not we have money we have at least some money so let's go ahead and do that okay so we will get a just an ice cream cone because it's the cheapest but wait let me picture this because this is adorable who doesn't think this is adorable i love how this came with seasons because it's so cute um like yes yes boo yes yes get it oh what's that starfish adorable okay what is this what is this little thing here uh, oh, Central Park. Oh, what's going on there? Is there a festival? Oh, gorilla thon Hmm. Should they head out today? I mean, it's the first part. Why the heck not? Like I said, I want them to have fun. Oh, by the way, I did not introduce you guys to the world. We are currently in Sunset Valley. Uh, that's because I do not have any custom worlds. Um, and the only ones I have come from expansion packs. And I don't have that many extension packs installed in my game, so, um, that's why. But I really like Sunset Valley anyways. I think it's really cute. And I felt like if we had a custom world, I would have more lag than I would like to. So I thought Sunset Valley would be perfect for this Let's Play. Uh, so I guess we can head out to, um, Central Park. Also, um... I will eventually add more community lots. By the next part, I will have some bars added and things that we can do together. But for now, I think we're just going to head out to the park. And do you guys like her outfit? I think it's so cute. I think it's adorable. And uh, it's custom concepts. And thanks to Harley. I got this from her, I'm pretty sure. I got so many mods folders from The Sims 3 added to my game so if there is some lag that's probably why because i just installed three of mods folders that weren't mine i think i got stefo sims jessimica's and um harley's my friend halo so yeah lots of mods folders uh but we're gonna practice chess i mean that does not sound fun oh my god honey this is so cute so 
okay can we join a group let's go join them this is adorable you guys don't even know we can all have a picnic together with just these random strangers but it's still adorable like who oh my god yes who does not think this is the cutest thing on the planet like on the sims planet this is so adorable okay let's take a little cute picture then because this is adorable everyone's just having a good time chilling out eating their little burgers on the little picnic like blanket like so adorable i love this i love it all right it's obviously such a nice day let me dress all right, so let's go ahead and greet uh, some people. Wait, oh, she keeps on wanting to play chess, honey. Let's not. That's not cute. Chess is not fun. I mean, there's not much to do at the park. Uh, there's some bugs here. I mean, bugs mean money, so let's catch them. <laughs> uh, but I want to uh, just go someplace so that we can do something together. We can have... We're actually going to go ahead and greet this uh, little lovely lady over here. And she got the ladybug, which is good. Oh, who's this? Okay, uh, Jacob, you need friends. So go ahead and greet Christopher Steele. I remember you guys when I first started playing The Sims. I would always live in Sunset Valley, and I would always marry Christopher Steele. I'd always get with him. I'd always, like, I did all these things to him. Sometimes I would try to kill him and, um... Just so many memories with Christopher Steele. I thought he was so cute. Like, what is that hair, honey? What is that? Like, that part build. Who does their hair like that? And, like, I don't know. He's not a bad sim. But he's probably the, like, best looking one in the town. Because everyone in this town is fugly. No offense. But uh, I thought, I guess I see why I married him. Because everyone else was, like, not cute. But, um... Yeah, little little story you guys with Christopher Steele. Oh, I mean, he wants to get married. Yes, and he he wants to have a great group outing. Yes, honey, we will. We definitely will. But who are we talking to? Who are you? This is oh oh wait, Jocasta Jo Jo Jocasta Jocasta Bachelor. All right. Hey girl, hey, how you doing? Okay, it just runs away. That's cool. That's real cool. But, um, yeah, you guys, I am so excited for this Let's Play. I can't wait to have children. I can't wait till we get, like, a cute little pet. Even though I know this is some pets, I still want, like, a dog or something. Because every family needs a dog. Like, every family um, but it is getting a little late. No one's really hungry, so we can't really go out to eat. But, um, we could go watch a movie. What are the movies? Oh, it's tomorrow at 5 p.m.? Okay. Wow. We can sort this. Oh, you guys. I have an idea. Okay, let's, let's quickly. So we're gonna go here with the group. Come on, Jacob. We are gonna go do something. <sighs> All right. So come over here. Uh, make out. You know, just get things started. Get things started. Already. Yes. Yes. All right. And then you're gonna give her hmm, a wink. A nice little wink. And, oh, wait, wait, we can take a romantic photo together? Yes, honey. Can we? Can we please? Oh, so cute, you guys. I love this. I love them. They're such, like, OTP. O-T-P. Honey, that is so adorable. Wait, do we actually get the picture? <gasps> wait, no. I thought we actually did. I got excited. Okay. All right. Now we are on a little date. Now we'll go ahead and tour the theater. Mm -hmm. You guys know where I'm going out with this. I think you might. I think you might. Oh, you guys. Oh, such a nice little date. We're touring the theater. We're going to go ahead and woohoo backstage. 
We're Selena. Yep. Yep. Thanks. Okay. I really need to get rid of this. This is annoying me. I have this problem. Oh, girl. They are getting it. They are getting it. Yes. <laughs> yes, you guys. Oh, look how pretty the sun is. That's so gorgeous. You guys. Yes. All right. I think they're done. Here they come. Okay. Do they have a little story for us or no? I don't think there is a story. No, I don't think so. They just, oh, she's going to stream a video now. All right. That's cool. <laughs> Anyways, uh, that's okay. What dumpster diving, honey, honey, I don't think so. I mean, why not actually <laughs> change? I'm very indecisive. I changed my mind True. a lot. If you guys True. All right, first part. Thanks for getting real crazy up in here. But, um, <laughs> you guys, so I am very indecisive when it comes to things. I changed my mind really quickly. And so I am very, um, distracted. I get distracted really easily. So I'll be talking about, like, oh, how cute was that? Oh, my God. Like, what are you doing? Like, I don't even know. Like, I will just stop what I'm doing that easily. And he found a moth. That is gross. Stop finding butterflies and dead bugs in there. Gross. Why is it appearing? In oh my god. You guys. Selena. What are you doing? <laughs> what? <laughs> you guys. My sims are crazy. You are crazy. That is nasty. No, you're not going in there again. Okay. Well, this is... Uh, why is everyone coming down this little alleyway? That is very dangerous. Uh, but, oh my god, wait, that is gorgeous. That is gorgeous. Can we just take a moment? Uh, but yeah, you guys, that is, uh, not how I would like a date to go. Dumpster diving? Oh, it's time to head home because these sims really need to take a shower. Uh, very bad. And I hope you're not flirting with this old woman. I really hope not. Can you please go home? Like, now? Please? Like, I'm actually very concerned for you. Just. <sighs> you guys, these sims. These sims. They think it's okay to dumpster dive on the first date. Because that's what you do. That's what you do, you guys. That's how relationships work. Yep couple goals that's what you would find in tumblr you know couples dumpster diving together Alrighty, guys so that is it for this part i hope you all enjoyed it i know it was all over the place because i am all over the place all the time but uh yeah i hope you all enjoyed and if you did please give it a big fat thumbs up for this series i hope, I hope you are all excited as much as i am excited because i am just so pumped for this let's play i can't wait to record 10,000 other parts for this but yeah, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed the video, and if you did, please give it a big fat thumbs up, and I'll talk to you all in my next video. Bye, guys!